Mastering, ought to, giving advice like a pro. Hello, language learners. Welcome back to another English learning video. Today we're focusing on the modal verb, ought to. This verb is often used for giving advice, and mastering it will significantly improve your English speaking skills. Let's dive right in. Ought to is a modal verb used to say what is the best or correct thing to do. It expresses obligation, advisability, or moral duty. The structure is subject plus ought to plus base form of the verb. It's similar to should, but it's less frequently used in spoken English. For example, you ought to drink more water is a piece of advice suggesting it would be good for you to drink more water. Using ought to in positive sentences is straightforward. You just follow the structure we provided above. Let's see some examples. You ought to read more books. It's good for your vocabulary. They ought to be careful when crossing the road. Your turn to practice. Try to form some positive sentences using ought to. Remember, you're giving advice. When giving advice on what we believe someone should not do, we use ought not to or oughtn't to. Here are some examples. You ought not to eat so much sugar. It's bad for your teeth. We oughtn't to ignore this problem. It could get worse. Your turn to practice. Now, create some negative sentences using ought not to or oughtn't to. Although it's not common, ought to can be used in questions when asking for advice. The structure is ought plus subject plus to plus base form of verb. For example, ought I to bring a gift to the party? Ought we to inform the authorities about this? Your turn to practice. Try forming some questions using ought to. Remember, you're asking for advice. That's it for today, folks. Now you have a better understanding of how to use ought to for giving and asking for advice. Remember, practice makes perfect. So keep using ought to in your daily English conversations and writing. See you in our next video, where we will continue exploring the fascinating world of English modal verbs. Happy learning!